Anyone at all? Anyone at all? So it's from Beijing. It's got letters one, two, three. Oh. Yes, you. E sixteen. No, that's not correct. What? What? It's E fifteen. You do. You're correct, Katie. Hmm. That was pretty rude. Still though, I'm I'm sure it's nothing personal. Huh? It's a funny joke. Of course it's personal. She hates you. So does everyone else. Alright, so Tuesday is a good enough day, and um, we're going to do some basketball today, and I have some gym with my friends. So, yeah. Jesus Christ, he's fast. Well, how hard can a push-up be? You. If you're not gonna put in the effort, then leave! But leave! Come on, get out! That wasn't one of your best performances, but you'll get stronger over time. That's how these things work. One push up. You can't even do one push up. You're weak. You should just give up. Really not a good day. Um, turns out I'm not as strong as I thought I was. Um, that's all really today. Man, how am I gonna pick up this thing? You. Well done on work experience today, my boy. Here's your work experience evaluation report. Punctuation five, efficiency five, competence zero. Hugh always arrived on time and was very good at what he was doing. However, I have no idea exactly what he was doing. What? A zero? That was completely undeserved. You were working so hard. Ha! A zero incompetence. Oh, I knew it. You're rubbish at everything you do. Come on, Hugh. You got this. Straight into the goal. Easy shot. They all cheer your name. James will be dust. They will statues in your name. You'll go down in history. Uh, un unlucky, I, I guess. 
Oh my god, you're so embarrassing. I can't even come out of the head to see you. Lack of skill. It's just, it's worthless. Oh, yeah. nice oh. huge! Stay, give me your money. Huh? Free chicken roll, let's go. See you later, weirdo. You, did she just steal your lunch money? Yep. Damn, that sucks. You know what, I'm sick of her. I'm gonna go to the back. You, I'm sick and tired. <laughs> Alex, you good? Well, that's gonna leave a mark. Uh, uh, I don't know, man. Of course you don't know. You've never known. I've been trying to keep him grounded while you got knocked out on the floor. It's all his fault! <coughs> I wish there was somewhere I could go in this school. Look, we're both frozen, we can't move, we need to fix this fast. Why do you always have to be so negative? If you get them so happy and then just let them down, that just leads to bad things. But is life really worth living if you're not happy? I want to be happy, but I don't want to be let down. Maybe if we work together, um, when we need to be happy, I can be happy, and when we need to be sad, you can be sad. Yeah, that sounds good.
Hello world, it feels good to be balanced. How are we doing tonight? Who are you? The name's Balance. I'm a harmonious mix of positivity and negativity. What does this mean? What happened to the other two? Look, man, I'm not gonna lie. Things are gonna be tough from here on out, but we're gonna face them together, all right? Sweet. Uh, do you wanna get in my head? Is that even a question? Of course. Probably went home. Who can blame him? Let's back to class. Yeah. You're right. To science. of our story was. So we made the short film to promote our YSI, which is Young Social Innovators Project. Um, and the main thing we were trying to tackle was anxiety. And we weren't trying to like solve it or anything because you know that's unrealistic, but we are trying to help um, with anxiety in the school setting and just help any kids that have a lot of built up anxieties in school and just want to relieve that, as you saw in the short film um, with our main character, Hugh. And our solution for that was to make a room in the school called the Room of Relaxation, where kids could go to relieve all of their anxieties and just find a balance between their negative and positive emotions. Again, as you saw in the short film at the end there. And we're just in the process of renovating and doing up that room and it's nearly done. And um, we're hoping that with this, we can help a lot of kids out um, who are suffering from anxiety and we can also maybe inspire other schools to do the same thing, which would be really cool, because really all we're trying to do here is just help. Um, and the short film is just trying to promote that idea even more. And um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> 